What? No, no, no. I, I swear, I, I would never. I, I was just doing my job, scouting. Oh, don't give me this bullshit. You look like your brother, but more retarded. Don't worry about it, bro. It was all for the greater good. Greater good? Greater good. The bosses, of course. And just now, you served up the guy the boss wanted most. I'm gonna throw you on those fucking spikes. Oh, you'll live long enough to see justice served. Aiden, you stay out of this. Unless you want to be dangling next to Damien when they finally hang him. Oh. I'm sure you've you moron. Oh no. Maybe I should quit the game before it stops. My weapons anymore. Is that Cthulhu? Because in the, the only way to repair them. Is However, there's an Easter egg where you can get Corex Charm, like you know, this Corex Machete. Yeah, I know. But what in you're this talking game, about. you can get Corex Charm, and it's an endless supply of repair. Hmm. It creates permanent maximum durability. Hmm. And I want to figure out how to get it. Well, I'm sure we'll find- we're gonna get all the easter eggs and stuff, we'll find them all. Now, what's this asshole want? My pee pee. Oh, it's this guy. His name is He's Dodger. a douche. He seems like I don't- one. I don't like you, Dodger. You dodgy piece of shit. Like yours? Ballsy. Okay, then. What does your hungry soul crave? Someone like you must know a lot. Out of modesty, I won't deny it. And maybe a little bird told you what might have happened to Lucas? <laughs> you know, I heard a pilgrim has come to the city. Very nosy. Grills people about stuff. Gets in the way. Sounds a lot like you. It can't be a coincidence. Sure it can. I don't believe in them. Now, you know anything about Lucas or not? Well, that kind of information is expensive. You can't afford it. I could work for it. All I need to do is dupe like 999 crystals and then I'll be worth it. You got any work I could do? Leave your CV with my secretary and we'll get back to you. Come on, don't fuck with me. I'm serious. You barge in here like don't you fuck do with me. place takes coconut sized balls. <sighs> Yeah, and you're Let's a one-eyed fucking douchebag kingpin. I say, pilgrim. Okay, I might have a small errand for a tough guy like you. Take does he you have dead on, on his knuckles? Worth yes, he does. Oh my. Minor thing. Need you to check in on a guy who's late delivering my order. Been incommunicado for a few days now. Might be trying to avoid. I'll make sure he oh, avoids you completely. Oh, you're gonna meet half-ass QB again. No one does. Who's the guy? Hubert. Half-assed Hubie, we call him. Met him. Lives up to his nickname. Need you to find out what's up with him this time. Okay. I'll come All back right. after I've spoken to him. Rule number one. On we do this mission at mid- and we do this mission at night after we meet him at Trinity him. Court. But okay. Getting to him is another story. The why? Hubert's not just a fence. He makes money where he can. And now he's hiding from half the city. He's super paranoid. Lives like a rat in a maze to keep himself safe. You'll need to climb up and find one of his secret passages to get in. It's pretty obvious. Hmm. I can handle it. When you're there, give him the password Sayonara. So he knows I sent you. Got it. Ah. Uh. Love doing the dirty work for people. Yeah, this is not a. 
a bad mission. Like I said, though, we have to do the half, or we have to do the other half of the mission at night. I swear to God. Okay. Otherwise, it's nearly impossible to complete. Guess we have to go inside a dark zone then. That is correct. But a dark zone that is intentionally littered with virals and other things that make your life a living hell. You know, honestly, I'd love to go through a a um, GRE place, a little quarantine zone. Holy a... mother of lag spike. Well, that's not good. It's because a flare shot into the air. <laughs> yeah, I see oh, it. One of the what encounters. Oh, that just go fucking inside? almost raped my game. Oh, I see footprints upstairs. How do I get upstairs? Shut up, dickhead. I'm gonna stab your ass. It's a little worth it to see that animation at least once. Oh my god. I hate that. You know that, like, thing you have where you can end up rolling when crouched? That thing is an yeah. annoying sometimes. It's beneficial, and yes, it is also very fucking annoying. Hey, I saw the footprints leading up here. I was up all the way up. And the worst part is, you can't jump in there through the pipe, because it just physically doesn't allow you. You have to jump onto this slab over here first, and then jump over. And not grab the fucking pipe. I'm currently bullying a viral. God damn it, I swear to god, this fucking pipe pisses me off. Okay, I guess I'm gonna go out here. This is the hardest part of the quest. So I need to get up here? Okay. What were you having trouble climbing on? Jumping off of the pipe into this room. Jumping off the pipe into the room? Okay, hold on. You're outside. Well, I can let you in from out here. I mean, Enter. yeah. I mean, yeah, I wanted to see the way you came in. Oh, that hole in the wall. Over here. Oh, I see. Here he is. How'd you find my secret entrance? You call that a secret? With my penis. It's a pick lock. You're out of luck, though, buddy. I still don't know anything about anything. The Dodger sent me. Dodger? And who is Oh. He told me to say sayonara. That help? Okay. Shit. You should have started there. Dodger's looking for the order you owe him. Uh, you see that? Busted leg. That's why I don't have Dodger's order. Do you need help? Nah. Wait. Don't go back to him. He finds out I botched the job. I'm done around here. And what should I tell him? No matter. He won't give a shit. He'll think I'm fucking him over. Hey, can you go for me? Check out this storage area in an underground parking lot on St. Joseph Street. Cross the fence right in front of the massage parlor, enter the building, and head down the elevator shaft. Well, hey, slow down. First, what would I be looking for if I did this for you? GRE containers. According to the rumor that reached Dodger, there was a military installation here set up in the first days of the outbreak. And where there's military, there's usually a healthy stash of supplies. Uh, what kind of supplies? Don't know for sure, but usually good stuff from before the outbreak. It was only the finest for the military. Medicine, booze, whatever. <laughs> no wonder Dodger wants this delivery so badly. Yep. Here, take these bangers and give it a try, will you? Man, I don't need these decoys. It'd be a big score for all of us. But go get her with a gun! Why do you work for Dodger? You need to ask. Same reason as you. We gotta do what we gotta because do. Because my pee pee hurts. Me off or I might <sighs> what? You don't make sense, son. Take a cup. 
tiny one. Why does he work for Dodger? Because his peepee -pee hurts. Guys like Dodger are barely enough to live on, but better than nothing, I guess. The worst for Dodger is to be above land. Nothing at all. Man, I get all. That's happened more than once. No skin off Dodger's nose, though. He's got plenty of guys like I me working for him. What happened to your I leg? I'm that trash away jump, because a punk like that is pissing the wind. Barely managed to get away. If you don't do this, Dodger will kill me. I wasn't going to be selling you out to Dodger anyway. So, this is a military base? Yeah. I didn't either, honestly. I gave half-assed you the benefit of the doubt. The base has a military side and a civilian side. The military side is a good stuff. The civilian side probably has more infected than loot. Look for the military entrance and you can't go wrong. Well, once you're inside, be careful. Getting to the storage area won't be easy. The setup usually includes generators. Find them to fire up their UV lights. <laughs> that'll help against the biters that'll be camping out there. Honestly, in this game, I don't like anybody. I'm more for, like, the individuals. But that's not a faction you can choose, because, well, it's individual, so... Both sides are both equally evil as well as good. So honestly, it's finding which side you're over will or willing to look over the fall A better show. evil. Like, the peacekeepers have a wholesome goal, just as much as the survivors do, but at the core, the survivors look for an anar anarchy-style level of living where people make their own decisions, whereas the peacekeepers want to enforce the law, just like law enforcement. So that's your option. Do you live life like you currently do, or do you prefer an anarchistic style, which Oof. is left upon the faith of other people? Uh oh, uh oh, ah! <laughs> uh. Well... If I was in the situation for real, I wouldn't be doing any choices because I'd be dead. <laughs> if oh, I did well. survive this long, I uh, wouldn't be choosing either side for anything. Bro, I feel like this update's kind of messed the game up a little more, honestly, in terms of like frame rate and stuff. It's gonna take a few. Ch it's gonna take a few attempts. This is never gonna be right on the first try. Uh... Call you. Uh, you guys need help? We'll be fine. Thanks. What happened? We heard a rumor about this garage. We thought it'd be an easy score, but we were wrong. Dumbasses. Hey, hey, at least we got far enough down to start up the old military generator and juice up some UV lights. So, what happened then? Further down, the underground parking is fucking swarming with infected. <sighs> Barely made it out of there alive. And then part of a wall collapsed on Jonas and our way to the surface. Well, you won't mind if I give it a try, do you? Knock yourself out. But it's probably not worth it. Unless you want to end up <laughs> like me. Or worse. Yeah. I Tell me you sound like that because the wall yeah. fell on you. If you manage not to die, maybe you'll find use for these. We sure ain't going back. Not that way, at least. Well, thanks. Really? Walk picks? Noises downstairs? I don't need no walk picks. Yeah, like peacocks singing the hallelujah chorus. Must be Howard. Oh, well, this will be fun. Remember, be stealthy. Yeah, I found something new. Take this. Let's see, where do we do in here? Zombies be sleeping and I be breaking necks. Oh shit, that's a hour. That's a oh, get the knife. I wasn't taking chances with him. Hey, baby girl. What? Better not be talking to me. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Why did I stand from my role? You want me to get back? There's many things. 
things to search. The visuals of co-op a lot darker. It's a lot more unsettling now. It does seem kind of darker, yeah. It is darker, and I know that for a fact because I beat the whole fucking game with this. <clears throat> I'm trying to make use of my role now for the stealth, and man, I'm getting stuck on shit. Move! Um, One way or another, that Howard's got to be dealt with. Howard's dead. There's a second one. Unless that's outside. No, that's not outside. That's definitely in here. I can't get through like that. Whoa! Why did that viral jump on the car? Why did the... I'm just gonna roll my way out of here. I'm just gonna slide on through here. You can deal with all the infected in there now. God. That's the second time you call me that. <laughs> You'll be fine. How much of the fool are you? Not my fault, he should have stayed outside. Oh, you're such an old crane. <laughs> you should be going out the door screaming, Hello, here we are, infected, come get us. The stealth kills still don't work. They didn't fix Actually, that. Actually, watch this. <laughs> Dead. I stealth kill, nobody heard that. Hey, it was still with a bladed object, not a gun. Although I have one of those. They're that handmade hand cannon. It's the boomstick! It's not a hand cannon. <sighs> Jeez, okay, don't... Like, you don't need your push to hurt so bad after that. My pussy does hurt now. <laughs> Please, where's my mitol? I need my fix. Oh. Nah, man, I got stealth. <laughs> stealth rule. You're failing miserably. Stuff saw me through a wall! Oh, great. And I was failing miserably. I should probably have my shrooms on me. Why do I have five bobby pins now? I left this game with two. Yeah, because he gave us some for this that mission. piece of shit! I beat the whole game with two lockpicks. I was never supposed to have more than two. I never was. Ooh, what do we have here? Oh, a new chest piece. I got a pair of shoes. And Charlie Brown got a rock. I honestly enjoy the fact that they call them Sunday shoes when you find them as a collectible to give to others. Hold on, that chess piece might be good. Artifact shit. It kinda got less. I wanna have a look at it though. Oh no, that's the bad top anyway. Ooh. Okay, find the jewelry containers in the abandoned parked car. Uh, so is it up here or? God, I can't see shit. The military storage area you were told me about. And you've woken up all the infected. Nice job. You know what? Actually, go fuck yourself. Mm, doesn't seem possible. You'll have to show me how. I sure can. 
Do you like shaken or stirred? Uh, I feel like we are starting a little something that you had to find on a site, and you know what I'm talking about. Sure about that? Like I said, though, shaken. Sure. I don't want to do this quietly anymore. Feel good. Never gonna have enough of these. I'm sure Dodger can. Well, here you go. Don't have to worry about that now. How did you even get in there? Really? Yes. I forgot you can just go past the barbed wire in this one. You don't even have to do that. What do you mean you don't even have to do that? I got a stick called the stud. I don't Execution. really know how to feel about it. Hey, 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 what you doing in there? Fucking bitches making Military money. med kit. I mean, I've already got... Holy shit, shoelace machete? Oh, you got that. That's the endgame sword that you get for free. <laughs> well, I got it for free right here. It's a, it's a, actually a kukri with a shoestring wrapped on it. I'm gonna put my UV, mini UV bar on it. <laughs> actually, no, best mom bucket. God damn it, Gazi. Look, bro, if mama ain't happy, nobody happy. We already know this. <laughs> if mama ain't happy, ain't nobody happy. Give me that. Give me that bitch. You calling people bitches? You can't do that. You have weak wrists. Excuse me, boy. This is it. That's but easy. When the hell did the game start calling these things easy to open? Because this is a level two mission. Looks like I still gold. Dip shit. <laughs> And some cigars. Mm. Cubans, the box says. Well, I guess we leave then. Uh, fucking like kids these here. days, bro. Out of here. Fucking kids these days. <laughs> Fuck you. Can do it. <laughs> no. I'm afraid you have failed. Oh, by the way, it's almost morning, which means that we actually divvied up our time so perfectly in this game that it was perfect. Although I really hate the fact that the sun is bright. <laughs> Ah. Wow, you made it. Oh, his dialogue, bro. Sure did. Thanks for the lock picks. But just to rob us? Sure is. Kind enough to get the goodies for us. Saved us a lot of trouble. Oh, hey, Jonas. So, and Klaus. Where did you find out about this? It's so a bad deal finding the bouncers. To you. Was it a little bird? Met a broken leg? How would you know? You're terrible at being German. Like Why'd you attack him? Huber was planning to take the goods for himself. <gasps> Tell Dodger he didn't find anything. Needed our help to pull it off. But we didn't know why we needed half fast Hubi. And now we don't need you. So, give them to us. Three against one? I like those odds. Don't even do I'm it. I'm gonna fuck you up, you Nazi bastard. Count again. These guys are all Let's mine. fight. I counted I count. five. Kill him and take some five corpses. corpses. We're not negotiating shit. Oh, hi, Mark. You pansies I did not are dead. hit her. 
I did not. Oh god, lag. Oh, oh, oh. Well, I did hit her. Yeet. would sell the story better didn't expect them to turn on me but then I'm an idiot aren't I seems like it trusting a group of thugs like them that's what you get for being greedy I wasn't being greedy just just desperate now I got a busted leg and don't know when I can work again what happened to them anyway now they tried to kill me but didn't Whew. Uh, and, and, and the goods? Did you reach them? I got everything. I'm begging you, don't tell Dodger. If you do, you'll ruin me. Please, d take what you have to him. Tell him I'll be back in business as soon as my leg heals. Why'd you even get mixed up with low lives like that? Same reasonable enough Sucking at first. They're uh, interested in helping for a small cut. Then they show up with this psycho Klaus. Damn it. I'm such an idiot. I, I, I brought this all on myself. Don't tell Dodger. Uh, please. Tell Dodger, be a man. Come on, man. Without work, I'll starve. I, I won't even think about doing it again. I, I swear. Don't make me laugh. You think I'd take your word for anything after this? Believe me, I, I learned my lesson. I'll never do anything like that again. We'll see. Off we go then. filters for one mm, okay I'm not setting my world on fire but I can move those for a nice profit how about oh, yeah. these a bottle of cognac oh, yeah, and a box of cigars now that's what I'm talking like about you see I knew there'd be something valuable at that military base what no don't tell me the dialogue is starting to do that skip shit no god damn it now I don't know anything of what's happening. Hello, I can still read it, so... I mean, I can see this dialogue right now, underneath that. I'll narrate it as best I can. Hubert broke his leg, so I went and got the goods for him. He could use a doctor, or at least someone to look in on him while he's on the, mean, on the mend. Oh yeah, still definitely need a doctor. What are you talking about? You know what they say, trust in God. I just skipped ahead for you, didn't break it? your camel's legs just in case, Putin talk. What? The psycho works for you? Well, two solutions are better than one. You wanted to kill me? No, who said anything about killing? I just told Klaus to get the loot. He can be a little over eager at times. You jackass. Oh, come on, don't pop. Look at Klaus. He's not mad about you killing his friends. It's natural selection. You proved yourself stronger than them. 
You came in handy after all. I don't know how to get to QB, but then you showed up. I waited until you were gone and paid him a visit. What did you do with him? He was in terrible pain because of that broken leg. So I broke the other one, for balance. That's what happens when you try to screw the Dodger. You fucking out of your mind? You need to get all broken up about it. The Rolex said Lex. The times we live in are ruthless, and the law must be so too. He's already learned his lesson, so he wouldn't do it again. Yeah? How can you be so sure? Any idea how many people have their QB is conned? People who are just trying to get by. Who have families to feed? He's been asking for trouble for a long time. He got what he deserved and he won't scam anyone ever again. Remember, rules are rules. With the whole world collapsing, we need them now more than ever. Without them, we'd be no better than a pack of rats. You call this following the rules? Your rules? You won't get away with this. Carl will hear the whole story. Carl, you won't dare touch me. I know too much about it. I know too much about everyone. Even Lucas who respected me. And what makes you think is behind his death? Barney? Sophie? Barney and Sophie are just a pair of kids playing in the sandbags that's too big for them. On the other hand, they're really fucked up. You never know what might pop in their heads. I know one thing though. Curiosity killed the cat. Thanks for your concern, but I don't need it. I saw the potential in you from the start. But I had to figure out who I'm really working with. You are something else, but you still have a lot to learn, kid. You lied to me about Hubie. Then Aiden, this is no world for a saint. A martyr, maybe, if you get yourself killed. At least they'll have a clear conscience. Clear conscience? Wonderful. No one has a clear conscience here. And since you're still alive, neither do you, right? What have you been getting up to, Pilgrim? What are you running from? Shove those tests up your ass. Twice the alike. We'll meet again, Aiden. Hope I didn't do that for nothing. I think we got it. Shouldn't have needed to happen in the first place, but we got it. Fuck this guy, man. Zara is just filled with unlikable people. <laughs> you just fucking you just smack him. You no, know, I punched him. Even better. Wait, I want to keep. He's just angry. <laughs> watch this. Oh, I'm gonna do it again. Watch. <laughs> there is something about full-on smacking a goon in the cheek. <laughs> oh, he's dead. <laughs> nice. door is not connected to the inside of this building. Wait, this is a building the zombies come in from. Which means this is one of the doors I've kind of glitched through once before. Dude, I love how broken the game. What the fuck? Hey man, I ain't the only one seen this, right? <laughs> this is your trippiest spot, bro. Anyway, uh, let's go to a safe zone. I don't know, bro. I really don't know. Let's go to windmill, and then uh, go find another uh, anomaly. Sleep and then I'm gonna have to. Oh. What the fuck? 
fuck did he just do, banana? Get this quest and we'll start a chase while we're at it, you know what I'm saying? Hitting on me, buddy? <laughs> Not at all. Although. Ah, no, something else. You see what life has done to you? Even your reaction to the word fun proves it. Entertainment? What's that? Playing a guitar? Talking around a campfire? Drinking till you drop? Nobody knows how to party anymore. And people need to unfucking wind Otherwise, the stress is gonna kill you. So, what did I do? I created this great game. Ultimate Fury, because it's fueled by emotion. Cricket! Ultimate Fury! Yeah! And what's new about fighting? What's new is you just get out. So if you feel like it, just step into the. Just pro. Alright, we'll do it after. I'm not doing it now. Uh, let's go, let's go get, try to get a chase going. 